I too, just like her, am terrified if it comes back that I won't be able to afford my, I can really afford my health care now. I mean, to me, health care in America has been criminal no matter who has been in charge. But now it's even worse and even more terrifying because now I, I work for myself and so it's saving my life. It's saving my friend's life. I'm immersed in the cancer community and I have hundreds of friends who are terminal. And not only are they terrified of what the cancer is doing, they're also terrified that they're gonna die before the cancer gets to them or before there's a cure, or, you know. And healthcare is outrageous. My friends have to spend $10,000 a day who are, one, who are the ones that are actually in the hospital. So I hear people talk about how they are, they're so upset because healthcare is so expensive and that's the reason we don't want the, this Affordable Health Care Act because it's too expensive for these business people and these people. But to me, I'm actually donating money that I don't have to my friends. I, I would rather spend extra money and work seven days a week every day of my life helping other people and griping about how it's too expensive for me because my friends are dying. And if I get it again, that's terrifying to me. If I lose this insurance, I don't have insurance. I will be pre-existing again. That's terrifying. One of my best friends, two years ago, her life was prolonged because of the health care that was given to her from the Affordable Care Act. She died a horrible death because that's what cancer does. I held her hand as she took her last breath in hospice. The hospice that was available to her because, because, it, they, because of the insurance. She would not have died as peaceful as she did or had that extra time with her family and friends if it wasn't for that. And I had a conversation with her about a week before she passed and she told me how thankful and grateful she was for that insurance. And I have tons of friends who are in that situation. And so to me, it's not about money. It's about life. And that's what I want my tax dollars to go for.